The School of Entertainment and Design Technology has been generating a lot of buzz. Its bar of success and innovation has been raised a couple of more notches thanks to the endeavors of yet another successful alumnus and the trailblazing efforts that are about to revolutionize the school. Come May 2010, the school will launch its Bachelors of Applied Science in Film, Television, and Digital Production. We had a chance to catch up with the school director, Barry Gordon, who has been busy conducting informational sessions throughout all eight campuses. The new BAS program that we're developing in SEDT, it's not your father's film school because the technologies in the industry has changed so much. Uh, part of the main focus of the BAS degree is that we realize that to create product for, for whether they be film or TV production or any type of uh, digital production, the technologies are the same. There's a convergence of the new technologies. Now the industry still exists. You still have a film industry and a TV industry and other digital media. But the way that you produce the product and the way that you distribute it is more or less the same. And that's what we want to focus on with this production. Um, the old film schools, uh, not just working with film as opposed to digital media, but uh, the way that you learned about the business aspects of the, of the uh, entertainment industry are very much different. And then of course the technology and the hands-on training has changed a great deal. This new BAS program in film, television, digital production is really cutting edge. I mean, we, Miami-Dade College is the architect of many of the new courses that are now have been renumbered in the uh, state numbering system, course numbering system, and other schools that follow suit with similar programs are going to have to adopt the numbers that we've already established. So we're really on the forefront of the new technology and the new generation. The school's AS program offers two years of theory combined with hands-on training and real-world experience. The school also offers internship programs that usually lead into employment, allowing students to attain successful careers right here in the South Florida area. Now, with the launch of the BAS program, students will have another two years to mature into their product and give them additional skills while attaining their bachelor's. Gordon tells us that in addition to perfecting skills learned in class, the relationships forged there will go beyond the graduation years. A college setting is really wonderful. If there's one thing that you take out from uh, going to film school or TV production school is that is the camaraderie. I remember when Francis Coppola was in South Beach talking about his uh, production last year. Uh, somebody asked in the audience, what was the greatest thing that you learned in film school? And he said, well, it was really the friendships that I made. These weekend programs that come into town, people sign up for them, and some of them are just one-day seminars, some of them are two-day seminars, and you can make a friendship. But after the two days, chances are you probably won't see those people again. Independent film director and SEDT alum Andrea Barrea couldn't agree more. The Spanish native co-wrote and directed her first feature film, Rough Winds, with the help of former MDC classmates. It was awesome. Um, we had a great group of, of uh, alumni the years I was here, so we still stick together. There's the crew that helped me out with, uh, with this film, Rough Winds. And um, the teachers were great. Uh, AJ, Karayasin, did I see that right? Um, was the was the one of the main teachers that sent you know they took us through all the different classes and then we had um, Reed was always like the editing uh, classes and everybody it was very hands on you know it's not a huge classes and you know, it was lots of fun I I loved it I was worried if I had picked right because obviously you're like oh I love movies but you really don't know I didn't know anything about filming and it was the I think first time in my life that I actually paid attention in class so I knew I was right. Some people don't know how long it takes to get a good film done. For Andrea it took her three years to get her project completed. Andrea started writing her story as a short film while attending Miami-Dade College. She says that after graduating she took several more classes that helped her evolve her characters and transform her short into a feature film. It took her six months to write, six months trying to secure financing, four months to cast and produce, and a year to edit. Her efforts paid off because Rough Winds first premiered overseas at the San Sebastian International Film Festival in Spain. The film was screened there three times. Andrea then had her domestic debut in front of friends and family during the Fort Lauderdale Film Festival this past fall. It was raining, I was so nervous, but everybody came out, they were so nice. And since we did so well, the Cinema Parodies actually asked us to come back. So we're going to be screening again um, in two weeks. And then yesterday at the gala, we got an award for Best Florida Film. So that was pretty awesome. One of Andrea's film professors, A.J. Karyachin, couldn't be prouder of Andrea. 
She says she saw the spark in her former student almost immediately. And over the years I have very good students, but Andrea was one of those very special students that you never forget. She was extremely talented, she was very smart, and I knew, I honestly knew, that she would make it one day. And I'm so very proud of her, and I know she's going to go even like higher in places than where she is right now. Since the classes offered in SEDT cannot have a large amount of students in their production class, professors and students are able to build a report. The school has designed it so that each student gets a chance to fully experience their own production by allowing them to use the gear, lights, and cameras. With each production class, we have a different goal. Starting with Film Production 1, right now we have four levels of production classes. With Film 1, we introduce students to the camera, how to set up scenes properly. In 2, we get into more cinematography. In 3, we get into more directing. And in 4, we actually brought all those skills together and have the students put together uh, short projects. And along the way, we as teachers travel with the students and uh, take them on this journey and, and a lot of times we have a chance to work with them one on, on a one-on-one -on -one basis. And I think that's one of the main reasons why our students are so successful because they get to do it even before they go out in, into the field. They go, get to make their own movies. Now, with the availability of the Bachelor of Science, students will be able to achieve even greater goals. We really think that our students are going to be at the forefront of the industry, learn the latest technologies. One thing that a community college does better, and we've proven it time and time again, than a four-year university or a state university, is that we adapt to change more readily. For anyone interested in obtaining more information on the Bachelor of Applied Science, contact the School of Entertainment and Design Technology at 305-237-1696. For Miami-Dade College in Focus, I'm Jessica Tejeda. This is a degree that is necessary to fulfill the needs of South Florida.